The Firm and the Nomads have a massive heist coming up. Surely nothing can go wrong, right? Whoa, no! I f***ing forgot! Ricky, I'm, I'm coming, buddy, you and me. What do you mean, what? But with everyone getting hit with radiation poisoning, Dave was reduced to a support role. I just went up and had a pee and looked in the mirror and looked at my f***ing head. What is it? You know what the problem was? We shouldn't have got hazmat suits from the $2 discount store. Or Pingerson. This is John Pingerson's fault. Pingerson. 100%. Oh, yeah. Is he around? Because, uh... We're gonna go roll Pingerson for selling us dodgy hazmat suits. Yo, yo, yo. Um, we're just down at the front of the garage just to pick up the two hazmats. Oh, yeah, you're here? Okay, cool. We'll open yeah, the just... door for you. Give me a second. Right, appreciate it, bro. Hey, hey yeah, guys, bro. we don't have a heap of time. We're gonna go roll Pingerson. Um, right, oh, okay. Yeah. You're gonna, gonna roll him, are you? Oh, yeah, on. he sold us hazmat suits. And that's why uh, Nigel's uh, bald because of it. Have you seen his head? He's got so much radiation poisoning that all of his hair fell out in a day. Oh. Not good, not good. Mm hmm So yeah, we're gonna head down there and uh, you know, motherfucker's been messing people over for too long, messing over the market, <laughs> messing over <laughs> Nigel's stupid bald head. Bad time. Bad time oh, to be a thing. Good. Beautiful bald head. Yeah, well that's true, he is beautiful. Uh yeah. look, that could have gone better, but also could have gone a lot worse. So you know what? It was it was it's very not... uh very much a learning experience. We definitely didn't mm -hmm. have anywhere near enough uh, potassium iodine. We'll know that for next time. Seem. So well, see, that, that's why we're gonna go up Pingerson. Is well, I don't know about where the f you got yours from, but uh, all the hazmat suits had holes in them. So you were getting the same amount of radiation if you weren't wearing the suit as I'm if you were. Suit, yeah. 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 So it wasn't that you didn't have enough pills. It's that your suits were faulty. Yeah, oh, mate, ours were I felt also like... holy. So we're gonna have to yeah. try to source some new ones. I don't. Mm -hmm. Did yeah. you get your? Did you get suits from Pingerson as well? Yeah, was it Pingerson? Uh, I you think we tell borrowed me. like ten or something. We already had a bunch there. A Pingerson! Oh, All right, what the Mr. Pingerson? Oh, I don't think Pingerson's a blue. Convenient. You gotta, you gotta equip your hazmat suit in your in, in your closet, mate. How do you know what we hear about? What the f are you talking what? about? Huh? <laughs> wow, <laughs> what? Isn't that, isn't that what it's about? Well, what's told you that? <laughs> What are you talking about? Why are you coming to kill Mr. Pingus? Who said Mr. that? What? You are, mate, you are tripping. We're coming to play f***ing cricket. Oh, uh, hey, mate. Well, there's some people at your house. They want to play cricket with you. They said that you can be. Uh, they said you can play field first if you want. So I, I would like you to delve uh, very deeply into this um, this theory of uh, the old hazmat suits. What's um? What's well, it I go? I got, I got told from him that the whole situation is about hazmat suits. Um, I don't know. John giving news. Hazmat hazmat suits. Yeah, defective hazmat suits. Who did you get told by? Him. Who did you get told by? Got told by Mr. Pinger himself. How the f does Pingerson think that we're coming here to talk about hazmat suits? I think, I think, he's tell I think Pingerson's telling us mother fibs, mate. I reckon he's gonna cop a, cop a torch to the end. Oh, you? why would Pingerson even know we're coming here? I don't know. I'll make a phone call. Yo, yo. Hey, did you guys call Pingerson uh, like as soon as you left? You only went in, Nate. Yeah, I'm on his bike. Yeah, can you ask him, did he call Pingerson the second you guys left our, our place? No, did you call Pingerson? Dave's asking. Um, he said yes. What the f Why? Why, Nate? Because we do business with Pingerson and the firm. Hey, don't yeah, get okay. angry at me. Get angry at Nate. I say yeah, this to all the time. I am f***ing angry at Nate. Because, yeah, you do do <laughs> business with the firm and Pingerson. You also just did a big f***ing thing with the firm. The firm has a lot of goddamn information on the thing you just did, and you're gonna turn around and f us over when we're trying to do our f***ing business. I don't think so. Wildly inappropriate, Nate. He's not f***ing happy with you, Nate. Right. Do you want well, me to give you Nate? Uh, do you want me to give you Nate's no. number? No, I don't. I don't want to f***ing talk to him. You we'll don't deal talk with this to later. Him. Now, if we go to f***ing war with nomads, guess what? That's actual f***ing RP. So it turns out, Nate. Called uh, Pingerson the second they left. And wow. Told him. Mm hmm. Yeah. Pieces of paper. That's oh, Jesus what the f Christ. What the hell are you doing? I, I fell asleep at the wheel for a quick second. I'm sorry. You, I saw you grab the car out, drive like two millimeters down the road, and then come back. How'd you fall asleep in that amount of time? I was very relaxed, we want to be honest. You're very relaxed! Well, are you relaxed now? Listen, oh, listen, oh, listen, oh, listen, oh, listen, oh, listen. Oh, I'll give you three oh, bets, alright? Oh, I'll free oh, of them, alright? Oh, my god. No, he, he's already lost 
a lot tonight, and now he's got sore he's legs. If he loses his legs, I swear to Christ, you're going to start losing body parts as well. But if, if anything happens, I'll give you both free limo ride. I don't want a limo ride. I want retribution. How about this? Put your, put your hands down. Hello? Hello, Dave. How are you? Hello. I, I, look, I'm annoyed. Because I love stirring the pot a little bit. He's across uh -huh. the street watching you guys right now. Phenomenal. I really appreciate that. Like, uh, no worries. Have you know, fun, house like... across the street. I, I, I don't know. I called him and he said he's across the street watching us. So. Wonderful. Okay. Well, thank you for that, I, I guess. Nigel, jump in the car. The other two stay here. Apparently, he's across the street. I don't know what the f that means, but uh, jump out here and see if you can see the little. F oh, God. I'm sorry. Okay. All right. Any luck? No luck. Well, old mate's on the roof, uh, his driver, who will absolutely be pay uh, sending him information. How can we just go down there, start causing pain and taking names, Dave? Yeah, you know what? Maybe we take some of his friends until he turns up. Right, I can't find the f***ing rat, but apparently he's close by. I'm going to come down there, and we are going to uh, grab a couple of those boys and uh, insist they call Pingerson back. You know, I've got his number. I can just give him a call. Yeah, but I want them to call him. I want him to hear the fear in their voices. I know that little f***ing rat is around here somewhere, and I need one of you wonderful gentlemen to call him to come over, otherwise... Unfortunately, collateral damage is gonna happen. I think this radiation's getting to my f***ing head, I feel pretty cool. Just, just need a phone call from one of you, I don't really I mind I give him a call, if it'll be real, I don't know. Wonderful! Look, 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 it's, it's better for the both of us if you just come to the house, alright? He's hung up on me. I know he's close by. I feel like it's either the house behind us, across the street, maybe diagonally. I f***ing know he's here, and I know that you know he's here. I'm just a taxi driver. Yeah, no, know but you, I can feel it in my bones. You know exactly where that motherfucker is. Which house is he in? Listen, I don't know what you mean. I just flew in too long ago. Mm-hmm. Now, I, I have the capacity to figure this out myself, but using you is going to be significantly easier. Oh, no. I reckon he's at that house over there, right across. I That's think so guess. as well. Should be Listen, good I'm saying that mostly on a guess, but also I think I saw somebody on the roof for a moment. Like, yeah. the quarter of my... Should we go for a walk, is... maybe? Hey, what the f***? I think that's right there. Ah, that'll do it. Right, Pingerson, come here. Right, you! You f***ing kid. You see what you're f***ing done to me? You ready for this, mate? Look at him. Don't look at me, look at him. Look at his f***ing head. Oh, no! Look what you're doing, dude, son of a Look what you f***ing did to me. Do you know how long it took me to grow my Dreadlocks. His hair was glorious! Hey, you saw the I... f***ing hazmat suits with holes in them! Uh, what, to be fair, I looked under my arm tip, and there was a piece of f***ing duct tape! What the f*** is this about? When What's we buy things off you, Mr. Pingerson, we inspect a quality inspection before we take them out on missions! Well, I rented them, I didn't sell them! I don't give a shit what you f***ing did, it's still a product that you are providing to a customer. You're a customer here, and his head is never gonna be the same. I don't feel the same, I feel Crazy. Things and we walked into an absolute shit show. It was as if we didn't have those suits oh, at all. Pingerson, mm. why the fuck did you do this? I threw up so much. We threw up so much. <laughs> they threw up so much. Listen, I I don't mean to be this guy, but you still actually haven't paid for the rental though. Oh, pay. look at this. We <laughs> have paid. Look, <laughs> look, look at the payment look. that has been made, Pingerson. Look at this. Look at this is the payment. I've never been more f***ing disappointed in you. I, 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 I don't mean to be rude. I know who this guy is, but who are you? Right, get in the f***ing car. Get in the car. Oh, no, get in the car. Get in the f***ing car. Get him. Is this Simo? Is it Simo? Oh, oh no. Oh, oh no. God. I don't... Oh, wait, I, I'm, I'm bad with names and voices. Well, well gentlemen, he not... may return. Hey, Pablo. Alright, champion. Let's go for a walk. Just this way, gents. Are we going under the pier? Yep. Yeah. I didn't ask if we're going under the pier, so why are we going under the pier? Yeah. Yes. But it's night time. All right, mate, stand right here. Aww. Right in the middle of those poles. Or oh, a little bit further to your left. My, my there left. you go, right in the middle. You are f***ing stupid. Back over here, dickhead. But you said to the left. Uh, a little bit between these two poles. Which there were poles lots of instructions you see? There. Bumpers. Whatever, don't worry about it. You're there now. It's okay. Stop. Do you want to roll yeah. 50k? Put your hands down. And no, I don't want to roll 50k. Right, so here's the thing. I'd like to let you know that I don't tend to get angry very often. It's not something that I like to do. Um, 
I, I feel like a lot of the time staying calm makes things a lot easier, uh, allows your head to be clearer, uh, allows you to do more things. Now, I was a little bit angry back there, so I feel like we didn't really get anything achieved. So, Pengerson, I am calm now. Put the f***ing paper down, Pengerson. From one f***ing ADHD person to another, I don't know, you've got f***ing something else. I need you to focus up. I know it's hard. I'm focused. Wonderful. Not, there's not a lot you need to, you know, have going on right now. It's just you and me. And that gun beside you. And the bat behind your head. And the gun on the other side. But other than that, it's just you and me. Right? So focus up. You rented us some really f***ing hazmat suits. And that led to us almost dying. We were hospitalized. We were throwing up everywhere. We may as well have not been wearing the suits at all. And I found out that not only the suits that we rented from you, but also about half of the Nomad suits also came from you. And we were all f***ed. So to me, that feels like there's a common denominator. And that common denominator is your dumbass. What the f*** are you doing renting piece of sh hazmat suits when I can only assume that you know that we need this sh to be top notch? What the f*** are you doing, Pingerson? Okay, listen, I'll explain my the issue, okay? They were haggling me on the price and, you know, you have to cut corners when people haggle you. Who was they were haggling? Who, who was they? The ominous they. Okay, no one haggled, was I lied. I, I, mm. listen, I just cut corners, okay? I cut corners. I was yeah, trying to make as much money as possible. Turn around. Aww. First of all, put your hands down. Second of all, Nigel, take your f***ing off. Turn around. I didn't f say turn around. Look at, look at Nigel. By the way, his name's f***ing Nigel. The one you f f***ing desecrated. Oh, turn around. Oh. Him. We're gonna, we're gonna have a little situation that is uh, not too unlike uh, a TV series, Breaking Bad. I want you to say his name. Nigel? Not with a f***ing question mark. Say his Say goddamn my name. name. Nigel Boris Minuti. Oh, that's close oh. enough. That's so f***ing close enough. You're I was like gonna say, that's pretty good. That's that's not that's not terrible, actually. I don't want you to ever f***ing forget. The hazmat part is his name. His f***ing name. Okay. That's, I was just making sure. That, that's the starting point. You remember Nigel. You remember what you did to his f***ing head. And you remember, as much as we thoroughly enjoy doing business with you, Pingerson, because you absolutely can bring things to the table. You have the capacity to be great, Pingerson, but if you f*** us over again, you will not have the capacity to do anything at all. Breathe, walk, think. You know what? That makes sense. I will not cut corners next time, I swear to God. If you do, Pingerson, I'll rock up to your front door and I'll turn your f***ing kneecaps into mix balls. Into what? Into mix balls. So Mixed bowls of what? So we can have a session. Put my weed in it. Like, like mixed, like, like, like a cereal like, bowl. Yeah, but what's in the bowl? Whatever we want. He's gonna what? concave your knees, you did. Oh, I'm crazy. He is crazy. Yeah, he's crazy. In radiations. a good way. I think the radiation's can get to me, Pingerson. Yeah, yeah you, listen, you don't want that. We had an operation tonight that was uh -huh. nine months minimum, maybe ten, in the mm -hmm. making. And do you know what our main issue was? It wasn't bullets flying from every direction, being shot at, uh, explosions going off, and super soldiers trying to kill us in, in pitch black darkness or anything like that. Do you know what the biggest problem was? The biggest problem was defective hazmat suits. You caused so many people to almost die tonight. More Could than I make an one counter argument? It, and it, there was an entire army of super soldiers. They did less damage than you did. My one counter to that, okay? In my defense, maybe, maybe a little bit more notice than like, you know, 12 hours to get that many hazmat suits. Well, we had about 30 hours of notice. So- I, Okay, I, mean, I could have had an additional 18 hours. You didn't get much less notice than we did. We did. We did. You got more than have double. Much to work with. Yes, and why are you just stocking garbage, though? What do you mean? Well, oh, you didn't give me enough notice. Why did you notice, just have it on hand? Yeah, why did you oh. have trash on hand? Why are you buying literal rubbish? I, I had to use duct tape. Wait, what do you mean trash? Like on me? No, the f hazmat suits. Oh, they're still kind of good. They, they no, look nice. No, they literally did nothing. We had people who take took their f suits off and they got. They were as sick as everyone who had them on. Literally no difference. At least they were worse. That would have been really bad. 
It's not a laughing matter. No, I understand. Laughing under pressure, it happens. He's in a in a high stress situation. It, it, it happens. Yep. I will make sure in the future that the hazmat suits will be up to quality grade, and I'll have mm. more of them next time. Right. So you believe that we currently have an unsettled bill with you? Is that correct? Someone owes me money. What for specifically? I don't remember. Uh, you know, see, I don't remember either. And I feel like you yeah, must like need to leave us, it like that, Fingerson. Yeah, none of us yeah, seem to listen, remember. Listen, I don't think, I think anyone think remembers. Just leave it. Yeah. yeah. Just leave it. Yeah, you know what, Fingerson? I think that's a great idea. Now, there's a lot of people uh, around here, and for years, um, they have been forgetting. Do you know how they've been forgetting, Fingerson? Bad memory? A bullet to the face. Now, I could do that, but I want you to remember to forget. All these people think that they can solve a problem with a bullet. But although I could solve some problems with that bullet, you are more used to me alive than dead. Do you know what the purpose of the firm is? No. That's fine. No is a good answer. You know what, Fingerson? I'm going to let you in on another little secret. Do not get your f***ing notepad out. I, I definitely was thinking about it. I'm going to be 100% real with you. I know you were. There is something that I learned a long time ago, which is when people ask you a question, if you don't know the answer, you should tell them straight away and without hesitation that you don't know. So I ask you again, what do you think the firm does? No clue. Wonderful. And you know what? For the most part, that's exactly what we're going for. But I'm going to tell you a little bit about what it is that the firm does. The basic concept is we're business people, Pingerson. You're a business person. And so I think that, you know, between one or many, business people and another, we can come to some level of understanding. The level of understanding right now is that a clerical error happened and the amount of money that you believed that we owed was in fact not the case. We do not owe you anything and that's great. We can continue to do business because of the fact that we do not owe you anything, mostly because we have in fact paid and that is in the loss of hair of the uh, gentleman behind you. And his name is? What's his name? Oh, uh, Nigel. There you go. Nigel. There you go. Well done. See, these are the type of things that I need you to remember, Pingus. And I, I don't need to put a bullet in your face. I don't need to do whatever it is that sends you to a hospital. You bang your head hard enough that you forget some. I want you to remember what I need you to remember, and I need you to remember what I need you to forget. So, back on track with what I was talking about. The intention of the firm is to do business with people. More importantly, there are a lot of other groups of people out there who attempt to uh, win things or uh, rule things through guns, violence, and all that type of stuff. We're not a violent group of people. We've not turned up here with assault rifles. We've not turned up here, you know, uh, with an entire organization of people. We've turned up here with four, with just the tools that we need to make sure that people understand that we're serious about stuff. What our true intention is, is that we wish to rule this city through controlling it. And we are in the infancy of that, and, and we were led astray for some time, but we are now attempting to get back on track with exactly that concept. So, the three things that I need from you, Mr. Pingerson. One, I need you to remember the name of the man behind you. One more time, what is it for me? Nigel Mutanaya. You don't need the last name, it's okay. That, that got worse. It's fine. Okay. I'm sure he's fine with Nigel. Nigel's fine. You remember Nigel's name, you'll never forget it. Wonderful. The second thing I need from you is to make sure that when you provide a product to the firm, that it's not a steaming pile of shit. You think you can do that second one for me? Yep, yep. Wonderful. And the third thing that I need from you, Pingerson, is to remember one main thing. One thing above all of these others. And that one thing, Pingerson, is don't with the firm. We will starve you. If you think you're in debt now, what I can and will f***ing do to you if you ever do this to us again will ruin your life. Got it. Good. All right. We'll jump in the cars. We'll take you home. And uh, you'll remember the things I need you to remember. And you'll forget the things I need you to remember. Oh, remember the things I need you to forget, yeah. I should say. Yeah. Wonderful. Have a mid no. This is not going to be a very good trip back. We'll take you to the hospital. Come on. I'll call my taxi driver. No, you will not. Put the phone oh. away. I do not wish to shoot you in the face tonight, Mr. Pingerson. Do you feel uh, oh, that you thanks, received enough babe. justice? Yes, very much. Good. I'm glad. Saved the firm some money. I love that. Oh, yeah. I just didn't want to pay the bill. That's what that was about. Yeah, f*** 
Dad. Thanks for backing me up, Dave. Appreciate it. Look, uh, Nigel, anytime, mate. I am. Uh, I am very happy, proud, and potentially some other words that uh, you are still in the firm. No, no, thanks, bro. No worries. Mm -hmm.